हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हवा यू ऑल फाइन गुड वी वॉज टॉकिंग अबाउट ए कॉलेज मेकिंग हाउ कॉलेज मेकिंग इज डन एंड इन लास्ट वीक सैटरडेज पीरियड वी स्टडीड अबाउट ए कॉलेज ऑफ सचिन रमेश तेंडुलकर ग्रेट क्रिकेटर ऑफ इंडिया इंडियन टीम राइट एंड यू माइट बी नोइंग इज नोन एज वॉट करेक्ट नॉट इज नोन एज वॉट ही हेज गॉट भारत रत्न मास्टर ब्लास्टर ही इज कॉल्ड मास्टर ब्लास्टर इन द क्रिकेट करेक्ट और नॉट पीपल एडमायर हिम एंड ही इज आइडल फॉर सो मेनी प्लेयर प्लेयर्स इन आवर कंट्री एज वेल एज इन द अदर कंट्रीज करेक्ट और नॉट पीपल एडमायर हिम एंड दे थिंक ऑफ बींग लाइक सचिन तेंडुलकर इवन स्टूडेंट्स माय सन इन थर्ड स्टैंडर्ड ही थिंक्स दैट आई शुड बिकम लाइक सचिन तेंडुलकर विराट कोहली दैट इज वॉट दे एडमायर क्रिकेटर्स एंड आई टोल्ड यू यू हैव टू मेक ए कॉलाज ऑफ ए योर फेवरेट क्रिकेट क्रिकेटर but no one has sent photo of making collage what you have to do you have to make small paper cutouts okay small paper cutouts of your favorite cricketer and that paper cutouts you have to paste on a piece not on a piece of a paper on in, in your english notebook you have to give heading lesson number 15 a collage okay a collage after writing lesson number 15 a collage you have to paste at least two or three photos of your favorite cricketer and information of same cricketer you have to write down in your own words or you can find out information on the internet and that simple work you are not able to do i don't know why so here it is told now my favorite cricketer now here it is told that there is a writer uh, there is a person who has written about his favorite cricketer who is he who, now who is the favorite cricketer of this person now here it is told that a young admirer of sachin tendulkar has made this collage okay this collage is made by whom a young admirer admirer means what who admires sachin tendulkar the person who has made this collage his name is what his name is not given over here but he is a young admirer of sachin tendulkar who has made this collage about the life and work of his favorite cricketer he has written about the life and his work and achievements okay what are achievements this cricketer has taken or what achievements he has got correct what achievements he has got what work he has done throughout his life then what uh, what what is there in his life his family members you can say then about his life each and every information is given in the collage okay i will just read for you this collage my favorite cricketer touching farewell speech now this is touching farewell speech of sachin tendulkar sachin thanked all the people who had helped him in his life his parents family members relatives friends his coach doctors trainers managers media and all the people who supported him now this is what this is a farewell speech farewell speech means what uh, when farewell is given to him when he was going to stop his play or if when he was going to retire from his game at that time farewell party was given to him and in that farewell party or you can say in that farewell party he had delivered a speech that was farewell speech okay next one is professor ramesh tendulkar now sachin ramesh tendulkar when we speak about sachin ramesh tendulkar ramesh tendulkar is who Sir, ramesh tendulkar is the father of sachin tendulkar so professor ramesh tendulkar sachin's father died when the 1999 world cup matches were going on now in 1999 when world cup match was going on at that time his father died just imagine he might be in some another country where was he it is not mentioned over there but then you have to find out in 1999 where was world cup held and sachin tendulkar when he was playing during the matches of world cup his father died in 1999 and what has happened sachin tendulkar he sachin returned to india just for little while and returned immediately he came for just he might have come for funeral of his father or some rituals he completed those rituals he completed funeral of his father and he went back again immediately now just think of this the person who is too dedicated about world cup after his father's demise he just comes for some time and immediately goes back again for a world cup means that is called dedication of a person mujhe thala kiti prem asnar ek cricket baddal tache papa varlyanantar sudha 
त्यांनी काय केलं सचिन तेंडुलकरनी काय केलं तो थोड्या वेळापुरता आला हा देशामध्ये आपल्या देशामध्ये आले ते आणि परत ते वर्ल्ड कप खेळण्यासाठी दुसऱ्या देशात गेले ओके ही स्कोअर ए सेंचुरी अनबिटन वन फॉर्टी रन्स ऑफ वन हंड्रेड अँड फोर बॉल्स इन हंड्रेड अँड वन बॉल्स एकशे एक हंड्रेड अँड वन इन वन हंड्रेड अँड वन बॉल्स ही डेड हॉ मेनी रन्स ही डेड हंड्रेड अँड फॉर्टी रन्स ओके आफ्टर डुईंग वन फॉर्टी रन्स इन द नेक्स्ट मॅच अगेन्स्ट केनिया ही डेडिकेटेड दिस सेंचुरी टू हिज फादर द सेंचुरी विच ही गॉट हंड्रेड अँड फॉर्टी रन्स आउट ऑफ हंड्रेड अँड वन बॉल्स दॅट सेंचुरी ही डेडिकेटेड टू होम ही इज डेडिकेटेड दॅट सेंचुरी टू टू हिज फादर ओके टू होम डिड ही डेडिकेट दॅट सेंचुरी ही डेडिकेटेड दॅट सेंचुरी टू हिज फादर नाव य we are proud of you sachin who is saying this audience is saying this what sachin said about his sir ramakant atsrekar in his farewell speech on a lighter note in the last 29 years sir has never ever said well played to me because he thought i would get complacent and i would stop working hard maybe he can push his luck and wish me now well done oh my career because there are no more matches sir in my life i will be witnessing cricket and and cricket will always stay in my heart but you have had an immense contribution in my life so thank you very much now he is telling that whenever i used to play good cricket or whenever i used to uh, score centuries in uh, while playing while playing cricket my coach my coach uh, ramakant acharekar never he said that you have done well why because he will think that if i will if i will say to sachin tendulkar that you have done well what sachin tendulkar will think he will he will think uh, now satisfied enough he will be complacent complacent means what complacent means he will be satisfied complacent means what he will be he will be satisfied no more to do hard work or no need of uh, playing or more or no need of uh, having practices or no more, no need of doing practices more that all things will come in the mind of sachin tendulkar so what his coach ramakant achrekar did not say him that you have done well and in this way this collage is made by a young admirer of sachin tendulkar and you can also make a collage about your favorite sports person okay whoever is your favorite sports person it can be women it can be men whoever is your favorite sports person about that sports person you have to make a collage understood please paste at least two three photos of your favorite sportsman and write down some information about the sportsman from google also you can find out okay that is your homework once again i'm telling you this week also i'm telling you okay next one here it is make a collage on any one topic i told you just now write a few lines up write a few lines 3 to 5 about the following a match do a match that you have seen on the playground or on tv now you have to write down few lines on the match which you have seen on tv or playground now you can write down first sentence which you can write down the first sentence which you can write down is the match which i am seeing is india versus for example india versus australia it was quite interesting match second line third line you can say that on the last ball we had to uh, we had to score f- four runs and the and the uh, batsman of india scored six runs and that was the most amazing thing of the match you can write any two or three sentences on the uh, on a match which you have seen on playground or on tv that is our first question second one how your teacher helps you to be, to do better in your work how does teacher helps you teacher not uh, teacher does not only bits you but even teacher helps you to give meanings of the words you know, teacher gives you she does what spoon feeding gives you answers of the questions you have to just copy down and then learn those answers 
so you can write down that also teachers helps us uh, to uh, helps us by giving us meanings of the words now teacher helps us by giving uh, question answers correct teacher helps us to read hard words teacher helps us to uh, what else you can tell teacher helps us to improve our handwriting teacher helps us to read uh, correctly or in correct intonation teacher helps us to read properly and clearly in this way you can write down about second question next one someone other than your parents and teachers who has helped you you can write about any person who has helped you your neighbors can help you your friends can help you correct or not uh, your grandparents can help you you can write down about a person who has helped you in studying okay in this way you complete question answers anyways in tomorrow's period i am going to give you all this answers of all the questions okay and then we will start with 16th lesson no formalities please how to write letter formal letters how do uh, how to write formal letters or uh, letter to the principal letter to the um, uh, educational officer letter to the uh, government officer that are that is what that is an formal letter which we have to write down and i will explain you how to write formal letters okay it can be to principal in the school now for you only letter to the principal is very much important so we are going to study about how to write letter to the principal okay thank you and we'll meet in tomorrow's period